return to learning to well continue my personal development and to learn new skills and learn to become a youth worker and eventually gain employment as a youth worker one day. Jonathan's inspirational to other young people, um, I think because of his attitude and manner towards everybody. He's come through a lot of issues himself in all the, the years that we've known him here. And I think he's, he's learned from those issues and he helps other young people. I've been a victim of bullying myself, not just because of my sexuality, but because of my size, because I'm small, always through school I was bullied. And I know it's hard to talk to someone about it, because at times I didn't want to talk to people about it, I just wanted to keep myself myself. But then once I did talk to people about it, I realised that's so much help. But that's one of the, re the main reasons I got into youth work, because I had a lot of support from the youth workers, particularly with my sexuality and accepting that. And I realised just how much that does actually help. And now I want to give that back to the young people I work with, I want to help them. Whereby he would just come in and be a member of the group. He's now a group leader, um, good volunteer, and really good, confident, reliable young person that I've noticed other young people that come here really look up to and go to for advice. I feel more confident in meeting new people, in working with new people, and in dealing with new situations that I haven't dealt with before. Whereas before the training, I wouldn't have felt confident enough to be able to do that. And now it I just go straight into the end with open arms. Congratulations, Jonathan. Uh, it's a well deserved award for you. I hope you really enjoy your evening this evening and with your guests and everybody else and have a lovely time. When I reflect on my development, I, come, I continue to think, oh, did, did I get here? Like, I find it hard to believe how far I've, I've come in the last few years.